Welcome to another episode of Bitches, Bitches in, in the, the Kitchen. Kitchen. I'm Janet. I'm Chris. Tell us what we're drinking and why. Well, I've been to Mexico with my family. This was actually the second time this year, dare I say. It's true. <laughs> to our favorite all-inclusive club in Alm Mujeres. And it's called The Finest. It's part of the Excellence Finest group. So we're going to drink tequila in yes. honor of your trip to Mexico. Yes. As a matter of fact, the cocktail of the week was carrot margaritas. Don't you dare make a face. I don't even have to look at you to know that you are making a face. It's pretty good. It's not as bad as you would expect. It's good. It's delicious. Needs more tequila. Holy smokes. Oh my God. Oh. Woo. You Alrighty. Like, you like it booze forward. Yeah, booze forward, not fall on the face <laughs> flat forward. And it so was while Janet was enjoying her family and her wonderful Thanksgiving in Mexico. I, on the other hand, did the responsible thing and I had a colonoscopy. Oh, the laxative section. I'm going to do the colonoscopy while you're on vacation. So I don't want you to miss out. Holy shit, this stuff's $18? You're kidding me. 45 daily servings. I'm supposed to buy this and Gatorade. So I have to buy the Gatorade. And it can't be red or orange or pink or any of those colors. This one is green apple Gatorade. So it's, certainly it has to be better than Glacier Freeze. Now I have to have four of these to go with this. Jelly beans, which is really all I care about. Uh, eat laxative. This and green apple Gatorade. And notice I'm going through the register, Janet, just for you. Because otherwise I would self check. Green apple Gatorade with water, because it's too strong without the water, which means you actually have to drink more, but I couldn't get it down without mixing it with water. I didn't use the Miralax. Mine was like <laughs> something like a prescription like i actually had to go to the pharmacy that's what jeff's was that's what tim's was mine is just over the counter stuff what was the point of the gatorade to make sure you're not dehydrated basically shitting until it's clear in case you didn't know i was um, thinking about you <laughs> i'm sure you were i'm getting ready to go into a hydrotherapy spa treatment One down, three more to go. One hour since I started this first bottle. They have changed to the sweats. So I'm getting ready to start bottle number two. It's five o'clock, turkey broth all day. And now we're getting ready to start bottle number two. It's 5.40. Bottle number two is going much quicker. A little bit of water to reduce the taste. Bottle number three. It's 7.30 now, nearly the end of bottle number three. Okay, it is now 9.30. I just finished the last bottle. It gave me heartburn for some reason. I have no idea why. So I did just chew two tongues, so that's better. So now I'm on to water for the remainder of tonight. So I have from 9.30 until midnight. Nothing after midnight. Okay, it is, uh, it's really early. It's 6.25 a.m. Now we're gonna go and get this party started. Whatever time it is, 7.30, I think. Saline, I guess. Signed off my life. I don't know what all this is. What do they do? Hook your heart up, I guess? And now we're just waiting. And going down the hall into the little room that I was being serenaded by Let It Go. The song from Frozen. Anyway, the nurses thought it was really funny. The process itself is fairly, fairly pain, painless, really, honestly, at the end of the day. And to be honest, when the, when the doctor comes in and talks to you, 98% uh, of all colon cancer can be prevented by a preventative colonoscopy. So I got a clean bill of health. They, they removed two polyps that they told me were no big deal. Um, everything else was good. I come back in 10 years. So I mean, really, when you yeah. weigh that out once every 10 years, eh, 
No it's big thing. Easy. I mean, the joke that everybody makes is, is that the prep is the worst. And I mean, the rest of it is, psh, you don't even remember anything. Except I really did have a cute anesthesiologist, as you guys are going to get to meet Josh. Because apparently I was quite fond of him while we were in our short time together. <laughs> How long did that take? It's cold in here. Josh, my anesthesiologist, he says it's better than wine with no hangover. You mean the stuff they gave you? Yeah. It's cold in here. Janet just texted saying she's getting a hydrotherapy spa treatment shortly. Ugh, yeah, she's having, she, yeah, yeah. How long did that take? But Josh and I over here, we were on the left side. We were talking about wine, I think. But the doctor said it was a 20 minute procedure. I had Josh, he was my nurse. He said that basically this is like drinking wine with no hangovers. I had two polyps that they removed, which, he said, are no chance of cancer. And so I get to do this again in 10 years. It's cold in here, but other than that, report's good. It's really a quick process. Uh, the whole procedure in of itself was like 35 minutes total. That was from the time they took me to the time they returned me. And uh, to be honest, I did mine on the Wednesday before Thanksgiving, which people think was hilarious. Um, and to be frank, I came home and uh, I just started cooking Thanksgiving meal. So it was, there. I had no after effects whatsoever. No negative side effects. They put you out. Did you not have a hangover from them putting you out? Nope. I don't know, the cranberries call, tasted fine to I, me. <laughs> I call bullshit. She was probably the happiest Thanksgiving prep person on earth. It was fine. Uh, if you haven't ever had a colonoscopy uh, and you are of age to do so, uh, this is me telling you that it's a good idea to do it. For the amount of time you have to invest in it, the, the, the results are, are well worth it. So, cheers to colonoscopies in Mexico. And, well, just a different therapy. You had colonoscopy therapy and I had hydrotherapy. <clears throat> good night, Gracie. Good night, Gracie. Now we have to do the alto. Outro. So, outro. So they've seen most both. of that. Most of that is, uh, yeah, intro. Actually, and she could use probably. She could use PSA about PSA my whole PSA crap, is yeah. the outro. Did you hear that, Mesa? Just use Make a all lot that shit of work. what we said, and then just use that as the outro. Should we give her a, a, a what? good night, Gracie? Oh yeah, we should probably give her a good night, Gracie. Yes, we should give her a good night, Gracie. I should have had today. I should have had in honor of my day a, a large uh, green, green apple Gatorade. Gatorade. Yes, it really, yes, that's, that is really.